Hello. How's it going? Welcome to the division. Two. All right, so I'm gonna open a party. So if you're in a friend list, you can join me. Okay, what is this? What is this message? This picture. Okay. I think I'm guessing that uh, that's the boss that uh, people miss, I guess. But anyway, so uh, I'll make a party. You know, put it on a community just in case that you're not in my friend list. <clears throat> I'm just gonna put it like maximum of four people. Right? Let's put a little farm. So whoever skips in here gets the spot. Farming. All right, we're going to continue this. Agent. Pilot Torres is cleared for transport at Kenley College. I heard that they, uh, thing. They reset this one. That's what they said. They said that, uh, the raid, or they changing the reset day from Thursday to Tuesday. What the hell? Someone just pushed me. Yeah, that's what they said. The party's chat is open. It's not about asking, it's about can you able to join. If someone asks someone in the chat saying that, can I join? Uh, next time I'm not going to say anything. It's because like this is for community. If you join a community, it's automatically you can join in, right? So. <clears throat> Cause like there's a lot of people like been asking because I keep repeating myself. <laughs> Not trying to be rude and stuff like that, but <clears throat> it's open for you two guys to join it. Anyways, alright, let's continue this. I need to finish this build. This merciless build. Still like deciding like what kind of like Thing that I need to put on uh, on it, right? Okay, knee pads, Petrov. Hmm. Yeah, it's like two skill power though, but um, what I'm concerned about is the, the LMG on it. I'll keep it, maybe uh, I might find some combo for that one.
I'm gonna do some testing on that self adjusting thingy. I'm gonna try to find like like the new sets, right? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to find like the new sets. <clears throat> the reason why is like uh they might actually give you like the talents, right? Like this one. So that's what I'm gonna farm right now, that's like the sets. And the weapons, I got this one, I'm definitely gonna like, I guess collect this one, but uh, if you notice it, you see the uh, gear score and there's like um, a rank on it, there's probably a better rank, right, because that's like one cross is like uh, private, right, I believe that's a private sign, it's like a reverse V, I believe that's private. But anyways, but uh, yeah, I wonder if there's like a higher rank on this thing. That's what I'm curious right now. I think like all this stuff right now, I'm going to delete it. Because like we might, we're definitely going to find like a better one. Later on. The unique named weapon right because like those are the best one <clears throat> no it's not about like me getting a sub i'm just like repeating my sub basically because <clears throat> radius and radius it's because like how many times I said that before already? Like it's open for join when the, the party is open, right? If you're not in my friend list, if you're not in the thing, it's like it's in the PS4 community, so it's open. And it just like you must like jump on in. So instead of like me asking directly in the chat, you can just like jump in there, right? And start farming. <clears throat> okay oh my god I don't know why they keep showing that it's so annoying oh it does change every day interesting I thought it's like changed by week so it does change every day oh huh. interesting so this area right here is specifically drops the thing. I wonder if like it also drops like inside the mission. If not, I'm just gonna do like a thing in there like bounty or something like that, right? <clears throat> Supplier was open. Interesting. More Mackey. Hmm. Oop. So now it's definitely like worth like checking the weapons out because you might find that special weapon, the name weapon. Alright, this is not the place that uh, I definitely want to keep on thing because I keep getting Muramaki, right? And this is this place is Muramaki area. So I'm going to go right here. And this is one more where I'm gonna farm. Just like I wanna find like the new sets. New sets that you find. It's weird that they didn't even mention that in the thing though. Patch note. That uh, the sets gives you 
talent or some of them gives you talent or maybe specifically some of the gears that gives you talent Fenris backpack this is new Fenris backpack a tree slotted with no utility no, I don't like uh, the backpack itself Um, no, I don't like this one. We're just going to mark it as a junk. Yeah, there is. There's going to be more uh, build varieties, but um, the thing is, though, that it took a while to for them to figure out this thing. They should have done it like when the game was released already, right? So this way, if they did it like more, like probably like much earlier than before. They won't probably losing a uh, people playing this game, right? But I guess they're going on the the right direction. But I should say though, it's they're going like very slow pro process along the way. Where are we? Is there like a bounty in here? Ah, we'll do a bounty here. I'm gonna work on this uh, merciless skill build first, so it makes it a lot easier for me to farm stuff. It would be better though if like everything's like generated. Friendly control point nearby. Target is near you, agent. Like loot changes on area, but I guess that's too much for them to, to do. Like the loot, like we must like rent will be changed. Well, right now though, like, there's no content in this update. I mean, I don't know if you call this a content, but it's just uh, two missions right now, right? It's two new missions. That's not really a content that we're looking for. And this one too, that's definitely not a... Not a content. PvP is like, they added a team deathmatch, it's still not gonna do much compared to like the dark zone. People want in this division is pretty much like a big dark zone where there's a lot of people gonna be in there, right? That's what they want. But they're still not giving it to us. Oh shit, where am I going? Cause that's what like... That's what people like play mostly in like Division 1. The big uh, dark zone place, right? So yeah, definitely like the looting the gears now. Before like I skip like all the weapons, right? Now it's like I will definitely like check all of them. Because there's probably like a surprise that you might get. Which is like the special weapon, which is named weapon, right? And this trauma is amazing. Hello, Seeker Mine. Can you please chase them? Thank you. They still need to work on the AIs on the Seeker Mines. 
Division 1's like uh, Seeker Minds is a lot smarter than Division 2 Seeker Minds. And they're saying that uh, Seeker Minds not supposed to be chasing enemy. You have to toss it like a grenade. Like I don't know who said that, but that's what they said. That's what I he heard. That person heard about it, which is doesn't make any sense. They should just change the name to a non-seeker. <laughs> Mines. Seeker mines are already fine. Like it's just they need to like you know work for like uh like counter react on those things like counter. Like for example, if someone make a really powerful like secret mind build, can like one shot people, right? Uh, they have this called explosive resistance, right? Instead of like having a hundred percent uh explosive resistance, you should have like there's a cap on it into like seventy percent. So they can sacrifice a couple of damage for survivability against those uh, secret mind user, because this game is like meant to be like a long PvP fight, right? Not like a uh, instant kill right away, right? Like you see them and then shoot them like instantly for like five seconds, and this person's dead. I don't think the game works that way in this game, but right now it's like it's already happening. Is because like. That's what's happening in Division 1, right? And people got used to that kind of idea or that kind of gameplay. So that's what they're trying to like, you know, like lower down all like the weapons and try to balance it. So you have like multiple choices. Not really powerful. But it's like enough to like kill a, a player on two clips. It's like killing a player in one cliff is not the ideal for PvP. What's going on there? This thing is going wild. Come on, Secret Mind! Come on, dude! Oh my goodness. Yo, I'm like waiting for that Secret Mind to follow those guys. So messed up. He's gonna kill him. I'm gonna shoot his chest. Is that where I already shot it with plus my turret? Let's see on this uh, set right here. I'm guessing like the enemy is downstairs. See this one, look at that, right? It gives me that talent. What is this? Backpack? Skill power is kind of low. He has weapon damage. He has critical chance. I don't really need weapon damage and critical chance. It would be nice if it's like it's an armor though, so I can change that critical chance into like something like electronics. Electronic, I mean. And keep that hazard protection. He has like utility on the bottom. You know what? We're gonna keep this one for now. I don't know, we might use it. But uh, that's not the ideal that I'm looking for. Yeah, have something in my, my uh, on iron thing. Yeah, so this mode though, when they add like all those things in there, like um, a special area that where it drops, now people are gonna use like the mo mo uh, the map more often, right? So they don't have to like go to like same location farming to that one place over and over right
<clears throat> At least this way it's better though. Now I can use like a strong weapon like boomerang. Oh no no no, I mean like a strong uh, MK17. Um hunting rifle. Or I'll probably go go with just like a uh, thing though, merciless. I think just like merciless is just like ideal, I guess. It's because like I can land a headshot and blind and get that buff right and I can still some do some insane amount of damage with my merciless Where the hell is the downstairs? The hell? But like those like plastic bottles right there, they need to do something with that one though. There's like a lot of junks in here that they, they didn't thought of it. They should have like have a um, uh, what you call this like recycle uh, guy or recycle uh, vendor that you trade this thing for points or something like that, right? You trade all this junk for points and then like you know it gives you some either like blueprint or something like that so people like more people like more often will collect this kind of junks right because right now like you're just gonna sell this like for what for a couple of uh thing for money you can uh, see all the stuff at the vendor right you can see see sell you can sell all the stuff at the vendor, right? Yeah, you can sell all this stuff, like all these junks, if this is what you meant. But I'm keeping for now. Maybe they might do something for this one in the future. But right now, this is pretty much like useless. But yeah, you can sell them for like 10. Look at that, sell 10, whatever that thing is. Oh, they combined this one, interesting. Right, those things is like right now it's just like useless, I should say. I mean, there's no pur there's no purpose for me selling it, right? Because I don't need money. I, I don't need thing. I have like all the stuff that I need already. <clears throat> no, I'm not gonna accept that. It's either he joined me or not. Any accepting anyone's invited. Unless like my my party is in private. I don't think I changed this settings anyways. Um oh shoot! My party, my rules, right? Hey, turret. Shoot this guy! Oh, where's my turret? Yeah. Come on, turret. Step it up. Yeah, I felt like my turret is being dumb since the update. Before update, like, the turret is just, like, go nuts. Whoever there's an NPC beside me, it will shoot it directly. Like, it won't even stop shooting it. Right now, it's just, like, it's just, like, lol. Sometimes it's just like staying at the NPC and doing nothing. But I felt like the NPC are like a little bit smarter on this update and quite tougher.
He says immune, but I can still like put your buff on you, sir. Okay, you don't want to come out? Oh. Oh, yeah. I don't even need to like mark him like that, but just in case if he has a lot of HP. Yeah, come on. Looks like you earned yourself another bounty. Well done. Oh, this one doesn't have talent. So I'm I'm guessing the backpack is the only one that gives you a thing though. Or maybe it's still random. Hardwired, I will definitely uh use this one. Uh electrifier deployed skill uh hive turret pole sensor. I wonder if they still they fix that one though. Uh, killing an enemy with a skill was just a cool of your other skill. And yeah, this is definitely uh, a good build. I will definitely make this four set build. But I need they they need to find like a Pacific. I think this is perfect roll. Four hundred oh wow four hundred forty four. Four hundred forty-four skill power, and then change that critical chance into like the uh, damage to elites. Just remember, like damage to elites now is thing. But the only problem about this one is uh, I need the trauma, so I will just like use the skill power to transfer it to the other one, other mask. And I need that explosive too on the China. So I will use a different set. I'll keep this one. So I, right now they, they pretty much like change the number of like the skill power. So I don't know which one's like the max right now. So I just like need to like find some resources or some info about all this stuff. Or maybe like the more I played, like the more I will notice that's the max. Uh, I will keep this one because the skill power is a little bit high too. I don't know the, the rest of it. It's just like I'll just leave it. In. Actually, I'll just destroy it. Tech spec and HD uh, results in the thing high skill power. I'm at 5k. You need to drop. Yeah. You don't really need like 5k. 3k is the maximum that you need to go to, right? You don't need thing. And yes, this specialist is definitely giving you 50% more skill power. So you don't really need to put much of it. On towards your build. So maybe you just like focus on like skill haste instead of skill power. But uh, my ideal build though is not this one. I'm going to use the explosive, the grenade launcher because that thing gives me explosive. So I can use like merciless also to increase my explosive on my merciless. That's pretty much like my ideal. Or pretty much like uh, testing. That's why like I'm trying to like stack as, as many as explosive damage as I can, right? So I can like work this thing as like PvP, PvE and PvP at the same time. I just need to find like some nice combination for it though. I will definitely use a hardwire because like hardwire is also good for PvP. Because like if I'm gonna use Hive and place it down, they will get shocked and then you can easily kill it. Right? Unless like, they have like a 100% uh, thing though. No, no, all like the circle, you know, remember, remember I explained like the circle uh, the talents, right? The circle target, uh, circle talents are unique talents where you can't stack, right? You can't stack any unique talents, which is like all circles. You can't stack it. You can't stack the thing, devastating also, but I felt like this devastating is quite low. 
I would say that they should buff it to like 8%, but I guess they're trying to like, you know, balance like the weapon damage. So people will use the combination of the skill and uh, weapon for PvP. So like unique talent, you can't stack. That's why like I have like different types of uh, thing here, like talents, but uh, this is just like a temporary one. Yeah, I noticed like the backpack gives you a talent. Maybe like the chess piece also gives you a talent, but I need to farm more. I want to see. Definitely want to see. That this is like definitely worth like thing now though, like farming around the places. Alright, let's go next bounty in this area. Jesus. Normal. That's why you need to find like a way to increase your explosive damage. Cause um Ooh, I'm gonna kill that guy first. Kill that elite first. You know what I want to find though? A special uh, thing, P416. Like, the gold named P416 is the one I'm looking for right now. I don't know how it, well, I don't know what it looks like, but I definitely want to see it and find it. Because I believe that's pretty much like the best uh, assault rifle that I know for now. Oh shoot, where am I going? Where's this elite? Let me track this elite first. Oh no, it's running away from me. No way, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna make like different types of build. Like for now, like I'm gonna focus on this one and then I'm still gonna collect like the stuff that I might think that I might use it and then I'm gonna start to slowly remove all the stuff that I have in the past I should like done it like earlier though good thing they increased the stats though but they still have it like you know separate the stash from the mods gear mods and stuff like that because like one gear mod equals one item in your stash and it's kind of annoying when they did that they should have like their separate uh, thing stash for it <clears throat> come on it's like gear mods are like small items right so it should definitely give you more space hey it's a name the enemy Woohoo, nice. Oh no, I might die. You know I have a skill. This is a skill build too. Yeah, the name enemy is like, it drops the the item that you want to farm, which is good. I felt like it's like a 100% drop rate. And then a small chance, a chance to drop it with the NPC like this. Alright, what is this? Another mask. Uh, ongoing. No, I'm not going to go ongoing with mask. I don't think I need this one. I'm gonna destroy it. Um, chest piece. No, not this one. Friendly control point nearby. Supplies nearby. Ah, that's good. The the thing changed every day. 
this thing changed every day. I remember this thing, this set right here, used to be down here. Yesterday, I mean. Where's the, where's the raid? Oh, the raid doesn't have a Pacific drop. Interesting. Supplies detected. I don't even know if I want to do the thing, though. Detected. Oh, whatchamacallit this? I don't know if I want to do the invaded. Okay, it's going fast now. Like, I notice it. Dude, turret, man. How are you not shooting? Does it have any vision? Yeah, he definitely does no headshot on like armored enemy. Ooh, it's a tabula rasa. What is this? A perfectly steady handed. A landed shot that stacks a does an enemy. Um All right, we'll, we'll pick that up. Detecting additional hostile contacts. Man, Merciless is so good. It perfectly fit on this glove. Merciless and this glove works perfectly with the with the thing trauma. Remember, like, the trauma is like 10%? It triggers 10% when you uh, land a headshot? Now it's like. It's automatically. Every 30 seconds. It's perfect fit for both. I love it. So now I don't need, like, this special ammo to get them status effect. All I need to do is just headshot it. Okay, we got a driver, which is the. Ooh, a true patriot with damage to elites? What? Yeah, so far though, backpack. Uh, I definitely want to see the, the chest, the, the D-pads, and the holster. Uh, true patriot doesn't have any talent. Oh wait, this is season eight. Wait, did I just get this one in here? How could you? How could I tell? Hold on, there's an option in here. Um, um, toggle option option. Rewarded. Rewarded. Oh. Incoming hostiles detected. What the hell? Okay. Fire in a war. What is this? Oh, resources again in Envoy.
It's also the thing is also good so they buffed the the explosive on the wow holstered 100% explosive damage so when I'm using the P416 right there's a 5% chance that it will do 100% damage on an explosive that's why I'm trying to stack up the explosive because like everything's like linked to each other Oops, I forgot about this one. Well, I'm gonna do that control point. I'll make it like control four. All right, I might fail there. Target near you. I just need to be in there, and then uh, it's gonna stop the countdown. And I am exactly know where I am right now. I've been here many times, <laughs> many, many times. That's the enemy. This one is only hard, so it should be easy. See? The turret is like being dumb right now. It's not it used to be. Secret mine. That was easy. Yep. It's definitely a 100% drop rate on the name enemy. It's good. Three point five incoming healing. Let's see if we can find like the new talent also. Alright, knee pad. Okay, this thing doesn't have any talent on it, okay. Oh, it does give you here. Interesting. Aces and eights drops in like open world now, not just for the raid. So what's the purpose on the raid right now though? Right? What's the purpose on the raid if the this thing drops in here now? Maybe uh E B Eagle Bear? Hmm. That's kind of interesting. Unwavering. Swapping to this weapon grants 300%. Weapon handling for 5 seconds. Kills refresh buff. Swapping a able to dis disable from all the weapons. Weapon unwavering? Wasn't unwavering um... No. I think it's... I don't know. No, I don't think they're gonna do that. It's a special loot, though. I don't think they're gonna do that. I doubt it.
All right, let's get out of here. Oh my god, like, I don't know what's going on in here, but, uh, my thing is messing up my controller. It's, like, acting weird. Does it happen to you guys in this one, in this game? Like, sometimes, like, it's messing up your, uh, thing. It's like you farm for name weapon with a perfect talent, but you can long, uh, but it can be lower base damage than the standard version. What's the point? Oh. I mean, Eagle Bear is still good. It can be still good for like PvP though, because like the damage, uh, like the tendency. Right? You think like there's like a delay, so you'll probably kill the player first before they kill you, right? So it feels like advantage. But at the same time though, like you have to heal yourself to the fully, because it might probably kill you. But it still like increase your damage though. See look at the differential on my good people one six into this eagle bearer, right? But I could probably like I want to find that uh, name people one six, the gold version, not the exotic. Exotic is the EB. I want to know what's the talent on that thing. Cause remember, like this, this called like this new weapon, which is the name one, right? Or pretty much like the the unique or thing. See, perfectly steady handed landing a shot. Adds a bonus stack of weapon damage handling. The weapon damage handling is kind of terrible. Uh, max is 10 at maximum shot. Landed is chance to consume a weapon handling bonus for you. What's up with this handling crap, right? I don't think they need that in like PC. Because their handling is pretty much like perfect. Maybe from a uh, thing though. Uh, this one's good. Landing headshot stacks a 12% uh, weapon damage. For five seconds, and it stack up to like five times, <laughs> so you can get like what, sixty percent damage increase if you like land all your shots. Additional headshot refreshes the duration. Jesus, does it like have to be like perfect, or if you miss? I wonder though. You know what? I'm gonna try it. I want to try this artisan tool because this thing looks powerful. Looks so OP. But the only problem about this one is like requirement is blue is four. That's not the ideal that you want to have on your build. But um, I guess if you're using a skill build, maybe this is a perfect fit for it. We go with the damage to elite is because like remember damage to elites also works with the skill build so if you have this thing on your thing definitely increases so you don't want the uh, i know headshot is good too but your skill build so i think i just prefer that way for myself let's go with more rounds <clears throat> well, maybe the game has some, uh, like, I don't know. They have some kind of this ideal on it. Alright, let's go trash this thing out. This wyvern. Unbreakable. Two offensive slot. Weapon damage, health, and armor. I would say it's a good, but uh, not right now though. I 
I can see uh, things in there. You know what? I must see what uh, thing sells. You know, that girl sells. Okay, how do you get, get in there? It's like literally in the other side of this building. Sometimes I get lost in here. But now like I know exactly where to go. To exit. Did they increase the sensitivity on this game? I felt like I still need like higher sensitivity. Sensitivity. No. Sensitivity is kind of low here comparing to Division 1. Look. This is the, the fastest sensitivity in this game. In Division 1, it's like, you probably like, if I spin this thing one time, I'm probably like spinning already three times in the maximum on the number one, the first one. Division because the higher sensitivity means like your better uh, thing like your reaction gets uh, better if you get used to it especially in PvP right and you're aiming it's uh pretty much like better when you're aiming down the site so you can easily follow or track down the players I'm stuck so weird all right let's see is he, is he here I think I'm pretty sure he's here though this is like the only place fa la 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 he's not here what the he vanish. He disappear. Or maybe he's here. Nope. I don't. I don't see him anymore. Weird. He knows probably that I'm coming. Ooh, bonus! All right, to hired wired. Uh, skill power utility in defensive. So same thing. They're both same. Did they said that uh, the mods is like randomly too? Like it's not fixed, but I feel like this isn't fixed. I'll pick it up. Just the five hundred. Three eighty one knee pad. Skill power. Uh you no, know, I'll I'll pick them up both. Hostile broadcast picked up. See, that's what like I, I like to see though, right? Like those kind of thing, like a bonus loot when you're just like picking up some loots. Alright, I definitely want to do this one on Cynic number four. So let's uh attack the territory control, and then we're gonna go uh, control point this uh. There's a couple of like blueprints I'm still missing. And I'm still farming the stuff that I want, right? So at least this thing, this game now is like gives you a like, a lot of like, you know, varieties, choices to go in a map. Either you want to do a farming on the mission or you can just like to do an open world and do a farming, right? Because sometimes like you get some surprise. Uh, critical hit restores 20 percent using thing. Okay, speed was the same thing. Didn't change that one. That's good. Incoming hostiles detected. Okay, what's the what's the buff on the artisan? I'm gonna destroy this one because I'm gonna try the artisan. I want to see if, if if I miss, 
it will if the it thing uh, that thing will disappear so that's what I want to know OMG what It doesn't disappear the buff doesn't disappear Oh my god this this weapon is sick So you can see you see the the, the number on the weapon besides the weapon Right there's like a number right there zero right If I land a headshot it will increase my weapon damage by 12% Right there, see? I miss, it's still there for 5 seconds. So if I, like, the more I spam it, the more damage it decreases because it refreshes, right? And then it's, it keeps on building. But the only problem about this one, like the scope, I think I need to change the scope though if I want to tank this. Okay, let's go, let's go kill these guys now. That's the thing I want to test it out. I wonder if I can transfer that perfect uh, rifle though, but I doubt it. I want to put it on my P416. I, uh, yeah, M no, not P416, MK17. I doubt it though, but I will still definitely try this boomerang. This uh, boomerang is definitely uh, it's really good. That's why I'm going to try to that make that critical build. Oh my god, my control is going wild again. I don't know why he does that. Alright, let's go put it back to the weapon. <clears throat> Definitely want to find this named Weapon. That'd be sick. Specialization data collected. It's just those two pieces you can only get in the raid? What do you mean two pieces? Eagle Bear? Ooh, knee pad. Um all right, here we go. I'm gonna test it out right now. This um this glove right here. So 30% armor regeneration, right? So knee pads. This thing gives me what? 27? So 30% of this like 2700, so I'm guessing uh half is um 13 so you just subtract that by 20%. You should be getting so said 13 half of that 13 is 7. So it should, should be around like 900. No, can't be right. Let's just say 700. Let's just say you get 700. Estimated 700. Oh my god, this I'm still confused. I'm still getting confused on this one. Oh my god. Um Tango? No, not Tango. Angle out category. Yeah. Alright, so we're going with the armor stats. So look at that. Right? You see you see that one right there? It's like uh two thousand armor regeneration. So if I put the hostile control point detected. This called self adjusting. It should definitely increase that uh, thing. Let's see it. Does they still have it like remove it? So that means not, it's not really a bug, but you just need to know. Yeah, it's definitely increased by uh, 800 at least. So that's what self adjusting is for. So if you stack up some armor regeneration, it pretty much like adds up everything. But 
To me though, this armor regeneration, it's still useless. Right? What's like 3000 armor regeneration do to you? Since you act like have like how much armor you have, right? Like what? 180k armor? 3k per second? I don't think it's enough. Maybe if you if I if you increase it by 10,000, I think I will do it. I you know what? I'm gonna try making this uh self-adjusting work in this thing, but I just need to like stack it up with like a lot of like regeneration, right? Definitely I'm gonna try it out. Can't wait to try it out though. Imagine if you get like at least 1500? No, 15,000. 15,000 armor per second. Isn't that sick? I mean, you could probably just like roam around and you're getting healed. You're running and dodging, you're getting healed uh, 10k per armor per second. It might be worth uh, worth investing to it. I'm gonna try it though. I wanna see if it like works good. This is a level four. Let's see. Woo! Love it. I definitely need more uh, thing though. Skill haste. I felt like my skill haste like is being reduced. Or maybe I'll just need need to make the set. Hardwired set. I just need to make that one. And every time my turret gets a kill, my turret. I mean, my secret mines will be up right away, right? So I keep. I can keep on spamming the secret mines. And if someone goes near me, the, the turret will shock the, the NPC. Or something like that, I don't know. Nothing works. And I can get my buff easily by just like shooting them in the head with this thing right here. And I can just like keep on spamming it. Or get that buff. I can see their heads though. Goodness. There you go. Toss it. Chase it. Ooh, a million. Ooh. Remember, I'm not even done with this build yet. I'm doing like a million if you have that buff on them. Crazy. Is that? It's already boss? What? Did they nerf like uh, control point four? What does that mean? Origi Ori Bill game? Alright, let's go move forward. Let's just kill it with this weapon. Detecting additional hostile contacts. 
another mask to Patriot. I need to reposition that uh, turret. Yo, get out of here! This is my, this is my cover, man! Woo! Love it. Seeing that all that set's dropping. Now people are gonna find some glitches where they uh, spawn trap them or like a uh, infinite spawn. I doubt it though. Look at that. Green and more greens and more greens. I love it. See, that's the loot that I want to see. <laughs> Loots after loot. Why is he attacking this guy? I'm trying to hit in the head so I can get some armor back as a healing. I don't know if it's working though. Oh yeah, it does work. But it's not really effective, the one uh, thing I'm using. There's a boss. There's a boss. I should not get a headshot this guy. Alright, got it. Oh, you're going to my turret, buddy. You're going to my turret, buddy! Alright, I should get a blueprint. Yeah, I got a blueprint. Nice. One tactician points. What I needed. Uh, another true patriot. Uh, I don't need it. I'm gonna destroy it. Um, ACRS. Yo, I hate rifle that has like high rpm because hey. like it yeah how's it going man oh not much hey you think you can help me do this real quick or are you busy what do you mean i'm over here in kenley college and i'm trying to get these computers and stuff but they keep i don't know how they keep getting the damn computers every damn minute every time i tried to do it, i did like maybe five six times and i can't do it because they keep getting the computer what do you mean computer it says to investigate the uh, IED terminals, so that's what I'm trying to go do. And it's got like three computers I gotta like keep safe from them uh, hacking into them. Got it, man. You don't need help. <laughs> if that's the case, I'm gonna come to you, Jay. Ah, <laughs> uh, I guess I can. I appreciate it, brother. Other than how you been, man? Uh, uh. Trying to sink in into this game. Yeah, I hear that.
I don't know if I'm at the back out or you gonna or you can be able to join up on me, I don't know. Are you on a mission? Um yeah, I'm over here on the um which one call it um the college, I think it's the college. Where I gotta have these computers not let them hack the computers and stuff from the de uh, detonation and all that. Let me see if I can do it one more time. I'm just trying to figure out how I'm gonna do this because I don't understand how they keep getting the damn computers, man. Sounds easy. The Eagle Bear that got nerfed. <laughs> Oh man. It worked good for PvE though. But it's fine. People are just complaining is because they lost their favorite weapon. There's a lot of good weapons out there. Yeah, I heard there was. I ain't tried all the new ones yet. Hanley College? What? I thought you already did this one already. Yeah, but I need. I'm just trying to get that exotic gun, man. See, you keep saying I failed. I don't understand. Like, I don't see nobody on the computer or anything. I don't know what's going on. I have no idea. Whatsoever. You haven't got that thing yet? Um, the rifle? No, I was trying to get it. That's why I was like, because I was the trying to get it the last. Back? Yeah, I was trying to get it the last time, but when I came back, they had cut the mission out. I couldn't do that all no more. That's why. Yeah. Well, right, let's go try that diamond back then. Yeah, that's all I'm trying to get, man. That's all I'm trying to get. So you're having trouble in normal mode? Nah. What the? Yeah, I, I don't understand. Oh, they got another computer over here. Then they got down there four computers over here. They got defender terminals. See, I didn't even know that. I didn't even know they had four computers. See, you don't even need my help. You just like didn't even know there's a computer. Okay, how do you get in there? Oh no, they got the other four computer when you was here. That's why. Cause I ain't never. That wasn't. That one wasn't there. Terminal access. Yeah. No, you have to capture the terminal C, man. You have ten seconds oh, you to, have capture to capture it. Capture? No, oh. you're. You have to capture it. Okay, so I don't even know That's why you're yet. failing. Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> I didn't know what to do. All right, bro. No, 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 no big. You go do what you're doing, Jay. I'm nah, I'm like... already here, man. <laughs> you're making me look bad. Yeah, oh, man. I made myself look bad. I made myself look like a dummy. Shoot. I didn't know what the hell I was doing. I ain't played it for so long, man. I mean, I mean it even tells you to <laughs> capture it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wasn't paying no attention, man. I'm like, what the hell? Why do we keep doing that? I wasn't paying no attention. That's my fault. Local access required to neutralize remote detonation capability. Agent, you need to take over the terminal so Isaac can control the network. Okay, there's A, B, and. So that's why it's so many minutes and stuff on it. I didn't know that's the reason why. Yeah, you have like pretty much like 30 seconds to activate all of them. That's easy, just run in there. YOLO. Now you have to defend it, and then if they touch it, you have to like disable it again, right? That's I what don't it... know, I haven't, I had never done this one. No, no, so I'm just, I'm just like explaining it to you. <laughs> oh, okay. So, if they touch the computer, I mean, it's like you just have to go in there, deactivate it again by touching it. And you have 30 seconds to do that. Oh, wow. What computer? Okay, this is cool, damn. 
Is it right there where you're at? No, you just like defend this terminal right now before they, they, they touch it, then you think it. I'm guessing this is gonna be the new build of the century, that's why you want it now. <laughs> Oh, That's what I'm guessing. <laughs> yeah, I mean, <laughs> I was just trying to just get this damn done because I don't see myself playing it that much more longer, to be honest. With a big dude. I'll get the objective. You just do the killing. <laughs> I really do appreciate it, man. See, I had never done this one. I have never um, got this chance to do this this one right here. I only got the one where the coffee shop. Oh and yeah, they it. did close it. That's what they did. And then after that, I was it. I it had closed. I was like, "Well, can't do it no more." So, I still think the Eagle Bear still is hard. It just doesn't hit hard for the PvP players that want it. That's all. It's not good for PvP. But there's probably a PvP lot PvP better now. for PvP now. I wonder how it's gonna work in the raid. I never tried it yet. I guess I'll find out when I um, play with the Eagle Bear. Which will be tomorrow, right? You doing the raid tomorrow? Mm, we'll see though, we'll see. Because remember, Tuesday is gonna be- they get to change the reset day on Tuesday instead of Thursday. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Because they said that right now in this update, uh, the, the raid reset it already. That's what they said. Okay, well. Man, they come in all directions. Yeah, they... See, now you have to capture that, and you have like literally 34 seconds, but the uh, prevention is 12 seconds, so technically, I got you already beat it. Okay, I see, I got you. See, I didn't know how to set up what you gotta do. Oh wow, now you can roll once you jump off and stuff, that's cool. I know, right? It looks, looks nice, the animation. Even like the, the rolling feels weird. It feels like there's like a gravity every time you roll. I could tell you that right now, because I got a brand new controller I'm using right now, so it's, it feels kind of funny. Um, I needed another controller. Alright, search for the comms jamming hub in the coffee shop. 
Yeah, I forgot what a coffee shop is in Japan. Coffee shop is in a coffee shop. <laughs> Whoa, what the hell is it? I might think my thing only hit me by myself just now. They killed my ass. Damn, I didn't even see them come right there. Sorry, dude. <laughs> I see people flying everywhere. <laughs> and you respawn? I said wait to respawn. It's like a good minute before I respawn, yeah. I'm coming up. I ran right into them. That was my fault. Hmm. I'm about to respawn now. <clears throat> Not doing that again. Running into people like that. Oh, I need some more ammo. I touched the collar or touched this thing by collar, so go. Uh, touch the blue, go to the blue wire, follow the blue wire and touch that one. Alright. Where's the blue wire at? Okay, let me see. How the hell you know where the blue wire is at? Let me see. No, you're just looking, you're looking at it right now. <laughs> you just follow it. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, it disappeared. That's why I was like, where the hell did it go? Okay, went upstairs. Okay. Where are you going? Okay. It's upstairs. Yeah, I got it. Oh dang! How did you get up there that fast? Oh, well, I didn't even know there was steps right there. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I haven't done this for so long, though. Uh, oh my god. I mean, I didn't play this for so long too. I mean, I play like the like once a week. There's no point of playing it besides raid. All right, order. next one is the orange with white stripe. Orange with white stripe. Okay. Well, it's it's it says it looks orange here, but it's red. So follow the red. So is this one right here? Uh, it's just right here. Yeah, I got it. Man, they got all these damn cords. Okay, they all over the dang place. Yeah, I don't remember all these damn cords all over the place. Like, <laughs> no, he tells you right here, man. We just need to follow it. <laughs> Let me see what you're talking about. Hold on. And the next one is green. There's like a screen here, right? That tells you like in order. Oh, okay, okay. Gotcha. Hey, go to that right. white stripe and then let me touch this green first. Let's so go to the white one. Well, the the stripe, stripes. Okay, white and uh, whatever color that is. Okay. Impressive. Yeah. All right, there you go. Now we just have to go upstairs and uh, activate it and finish. Okay, there you go. It's activated. It's working. We're getting a location on the mobile shade server. Shit, I lost it. Keep going. I'll keep working here. I'll send your coordinates if I get a lock on the server. Is there anything that you're looking for today or no? I'm looking for everything. Do you have that? <laughs> well, fortunately, I have to deconstruct everything I got because I'm trying to sell stuff. I don't have no room. I'm gonna stand there. Search for outing for lecture lecture hall. So the best way to tell, like, if you get lost in here, like, usually on like the the doors, there's like names, right? Right. That's men's washroom. <laughs> you don't want to go there. <laughs> All right. So. Restaurant. 
But sometimes though, if you get lost though, there's like a diamond will tell you where exactly to go to. Yeah, I know. That's why I usually wait for it and I'll stream it early. I was like, man, I look like a fool streaming this crap. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> 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 I start streaming. Okay. Yeah, I usually just wait for that diamond to pop up, but it takes too much time. Because I know you got another thing, but Subway, I think the Subway, I got to the Subway and that's when I had, you know, had, they had kicked me out of it. I was like, okay, whatever. This is far, okay, lecture like hole, it tells you right there. And this enemy. Uh, he just shot the thing down, but okay. <laughs> oh, wait, did it fall? Yeah, it fell. Well, fireworks going on in there. I love this hardwire, man. It's my favorite gear, so it be... It's good now, though. Before it wasn't, because you can be losing like that explosive damage stuff. Uh, this one you have to like put them on flame, right? Uh, so you, you can put them so on you, fire. you can damage them. If you don't put them on fire, they're not taking any damage. Oh damn! So okay. best way is like you pick up some special weapon or special ammo. Okay, the or like use the fire threat or whatever. But uh, when they're burning though, that's where they begin to take some big damage. Damn, I ran out of that real quick. Why did he look like he was running like he was about to blow me up just now? Why is it? I need to see if I have some more grenades. Fire grenades. Uh, nah, I got the stupid sniper rifle thing on, that's why. Oh shoot, my thing ammo is a bit uh, some more ammo. Oh, you can't shoot at them at all, so fire has got to be the Yeah, main you have to keys. burn them, yeah. Wow. That's crazy. Careful, Jay. Let me see, I'm trying to get another turn on real quick. I don't know if it's going to work, but I'm going to burn this motherfucker. Literally, like following me. <laughs> oh, oh god! Let me deconstruct this stuff so I can pick up some more shit and then give you some stuff. Oh! I is that. And the other ones are okay that you could just shoot at them and kill them, right? Yeah. That's basically it. Get down, get down. Where the hell is that? Oh, they have top now? There's kids up there. Don't seek a mine up there. Let's go back to Echo. Let's do the last one. Get these tools right here. Jack Arnold was Proteus' squad leader. And her last sit rep, 
Turn back and it was. Okay, search the lecture hall. Alright, lecture hall is pretty much the same area that we went to. That's the coffee shop we just went through, okay. They keep putting us back over here. Okay, so okay. Ooh, LMG. So I noticed like they drop like those gear mods Ooh. now more often. More frequently. How, how oh, you want this right here? Let me see. What is this? I don't know, man. If you're dropping it, that means you don't want it. It's a junk. No, it's not a joke. I don't joke like you joke. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Wait, you don't want it because you're defense. dropping, you're giving it to me, so it means it's a junk item. Oh wow! Oh, okay, I, I got. I never done the share thing. This is new. Okay. There's a key. One of these fuckers. Check that out, Jay. It's got thirty percent on um, hazmat. Knee pants. Why do you give me a purple? You're gonna take the purple. They got the <laughs> look at the. You don't want it. Yeah, those, the, uh, those, those are special talents. Everyone has that now. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> okay, so now I'll give you gold then. I didn't know. That, yeah, they, they, they added that. They changed that like this recent update. Okay. Oh my god, my aim sucks. Done. There's another long range coming around here. Where is she going now? Protect her. She going. Another it's leaving room. us. I know, right? But it's, like, killed. it's like, I don't want this nonsense. I'm out of here. <laughs> oh, damn, I lost the Richie Oak. Okay. Damn, where are they coming from? God, you keep coming everywhere. Last 
last yeah, one. Watch my back. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> oh god. <clears throat> Running into walls and shit. That's everything, you finished it. Alright. I'm following her like I'm gonna go through that door with her. Alright, now I gotta do the subway, that's it. Oh, you're pretty much like done, yeah, you're done this place. How you get out of here? Let's see. Coffee shop. Not that. Okay, the only way over here. Oh, you haven't even got that supply room yet. Yeah, I'll, What's I'll the room? open it for you. Oh no, I don't think you can. You didn't get, get it. Get it. Oh, once you complete it, it locks everything down, huh? That's crazy. Yeah. Get the best item in that supply. Great. Alright, good luck. Well, I appreciate it, man. Alright. Thanks for getting our <laughs> It's actually speed running here, but I'll do that in the future. Because there's a lot of things that I want to do first before a thing. <clears throat> yeah, there's a lot of things that I need to do first before, like, you know, trying to attempt that. And I want to make, like, a, a perfect build for those kind of, for this thing, right? So, yeah, let's go back to farming again. So, I'm going to finish this try to finish this build first, and then I'm going to work on my tank build. Then we're going to make that PVP build on um tomorrow. That's tomorrow, yeah. Yeah, tomorrow. So, I'm trying to like stack it up like as much as I can and then it's like start put like everything together. And I need to find like all this new uh thing. New talents. Because some of the talents is like works perfectly to each other, so like we definitely need to find those things. Like for for example, um the kneecap one. When you shot someone and then they get bleed, and then you have that uh status effect, incre increase your damage. Now it's just like you're just putting them on bleed and also like you also using some the bleed increasing damage on bleed right like uh, ongoing directive. So if we combine those two right there plus the seeker mines with that bleed oh my god. <clears throat> That's why like I want to try like do a different combination not just like for like weapon damage and like raw damage. I like to mix things up. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? 
right? Good thing I found this skilled. I need that skilled right there. Well, I will change that uh, insulated though. Put that somewhere in some of my build. On the rope is still the same thing. Tech support and skill is a good combination now because like you don't need the explosive and you can use the explosive on one of the gears here, right? And then I don't have to like wear the ongoing directive anymore, right? I can just like steal that explosive damage and transfer it to the other build or other gears. Like for example, like this one right here, you can just like transfer it in Alps. Have like two utilities in here that has like defensive and thing, right? So I can have the, I can have that skill haze over there. Because remember like before when I'm using the, uh, uh, this ongoing directive is because of the explosive damage, right? Since that you can easily transfer it on certain gears, you can do that. So I don't have to go with ongoing directives, but you still have to find some ongoing directives. So if you want to require the, the highest like explosive damage on a chest piece because like that's the only gear that uh, drops the explosive damage unless that they change something in this update that I didn't know about right remember like uh, ongoing directive is supposed to be two utilities uh, mod slots but they changed that into a offensive defensive and utility now so so it goes by three it's not four anymore but it's still like doing insane amount of damage right and then like the back, I mean like the knee pads now that like, gives you that two utility on uh thing Petrov knee pad. So we're gonna try to find this Petrov and then change this one, this Petrov, into like um Um I don't know if I just wanna go with entrench. Maybe I'll just remove that entrench and just put like surge instead. Because I don't think I need this thing right here. This one though, the while in covered composure, we're probably gonna use that in some different build. Or probably maybe like the PVE build or something like that. But we're just gonna use that uh, two uh, two attributes in that knee pad right here, because I think this is like the only one that gives you the two utilities one. You probably like don't need that entrenched though, but uh, it should probably still be useful though. And uh, for the holster, I'm not sure where I'm gonna put the holster. Maybe I'll just like put the explosive damage and some skill haste, and then have that utility right there in the bottom, which is perfect. What am I wearing right now? Damage to elite. Yeah, I still need that damage to elite because remember, like damage to elite also increases your damage on your skill build. If you're hitting elites. So now I need to find a ops. This ops right here. I need to find this. That has a. Um, maybe destructive is the one I'm looking for. Probably like insulated. But yeah I'm going to look for ops. A good ops. Right. We don't need that weapon damage. We just want some uh, good utility slots. Or maybe, uh, and then I'm going to use a, um, not Ops backpack. I'm going to be using the, probably hardwired backpack is because this thing gives me a, uh, a talent, right? So far, backpack is the only one that gives you a talent. As a set. That's the only thing I know so far. Um, I already found the, the mask. The holster. The knee pads. I haven't found any chest piece yet. So I'm not sure if the chest piece gives you the. The utility that you need. Or the talent. Even the glove. I haven't seen the glove yet. Drop. So we're going to farm more. But yeah, so 
This is what I'm talking about, right? So uh, I'll be using the Alps. Where's this Alps? Right? And then I'm going to change this critical damage into one of my explosive damage on my thing, right? Remember that this thing doesn't have to be in your inventory. You can put it on the stash. That's like all, like, pretty much like it picks like all the stuff in your stash, right? All the possibly. So I'll be using this one right here and put it in there. And have that explosive damage combination with the skill power. And have that destructive also. So it works perfectly. So we, that's why I'm going to keep on farming. So I can easily make uh, certain builds, right? So like all the stuff you found right now, just like dump it in here. Right? You don't have to carry it anymore, which is good. Just dump it in there. Because it also picks in your uh, thing, the stash. Like all the stats on your stash, it will be in those uh, re recalibration. So now you can farm for more until like your stash just gets filled up. Before it's like I don't even put it in the stashes because like stash is always full. Now it's like I have all this stuff. And then I can farm for more, right? But some of this stuff though, I definitely gonna delete it because I probably not gonna need it. But it's gonna be good though, can't wait. Alright, let's go do, do more farming and then uh, we'll be using the Merciless again. And then we're gonna put more points in here. Yeah, yeah. EMP grenade though. Let me see what's a good one in here. I think I'm gonna activate this one. So my thing won't get uh, disrupted. Wait, what? Faraday? What is Faraday? This one's Faraday, right? But uh... The hell? Wait, how many points do you need? Nine. Oh, I only have seven points. Oops. Wait. Alright, so I lost that power. One. Alright, turn it. Nah, let's just put one more. Alright, that should be enough, right? Because like, 3,000 is all I need. And is it active? Yes, it is. 29.58. The thing as I need is like 29.16 is the only thing I need. Okay, we're good. Let me see the secret mines I have in here. You definitely want the cluster in here, like definitely want cluster, because like they nerfed the how many clusters in the secret mines from four to three, right? If you re if I remove this one, now I only have like three numbers of clusters instead of like things. That's why you need to find this six right here. I don't know if there's like seven or eight, but yes, yeah, six is definitely a good number. The higher the number, the better. And then one of them is like damage, of course. And then just use the skill haze. I prefer skill haze over damage in this one because like look at that timer. Look at this big difference in this number if I switch it to the damage. Like I know you like increasing your damage, but like the cooldown though, it's kinda like uh kinda annoying. But remember this though. If you can you can do that damage, like twice as much damage. Right? If you apply like damage in here without that skill haze, you need hardwired. Like a full set of hardwired is a good set. I think I put it in here. That's what I'm gonna do right now though. I'm gonna do like which ones like give me more benefit. 
Because I don't need to wait for the cooldown. So once I toss that secret mines and my turret kills one. Because usually my kill my turret like kills like one, right? Right away. And then get that buff right away, right? See right there, like killing with a skill resets a cooldown of your other skill. So that means like I don't have to wait for the cooldown. So every time I toss the secret mines, it does insane amount of damage, and then the cooldown is 30 seconds, and then the turret will kill one NPC. Which is like my turret does insane amount of damage anyways. And then my secret mine should be up already. So I don't really need skill haze in my build. But you do need skill haze on your turret. Because turret is like you have to like dump it. Right? To get a fresh one just in case it get destroyed. You definitely need skill haze on this one though. I want to put like damage, but uh, uh, I think skill haste will definitely do the work. It does like a lot of damage already, so it should be fine. But I need to find like this this version right here, like higher version one. Cause like, I believe the this the thing again is like uh, maximum is three thousand skill power. Right? They didn't change that uh, requirement. See the thing. I need to find like the thing with the highest damage one. But the only problem about this one though, they did nerf the auxiliary battery in this one. Remember this thing it goes up to like 1000 plus? Now I was like, look at this. They nerfed it so bad that I just want to just destroy them. I don't even think I need those things, to be honest. Alright, let's get more uh, things set. And here we go again. Alright, we're gonna go to this area right here. Because this is where it gives me all the sets. And I need all the sets that I can get, right? Uh, the other stuff is like, I could care this though. But uh, if you still like need a uh, good AR though. Just find the one with the AR. Which is, um, is this AR? Assault Rifle? Yes. So you never know, you might get that uh, special weapon, um, E416. You know what, I'm going to do like one of this one, one mission of this. And let's see if I can manage to get that uh, named assault rifle. Imagine though, like you get like a special optimistic. P416 like that special right there like perfectly steady handed but like in optimistic yo yo this is a different enemy did you see the thing his um, icon is like loot it's like a hand with the coins. Interesting. I never seen that enemy. And I never seen an enemy does like that. Like he's waving at me. Alright, we're going going with uh I wanna go with Wait, what's the difference though? Um, Alright. What? <laughs> it doesn't tell you how much it drops now. I mean, let's go with daily because it gives you bonus reward, right? So... Let's do that daily. I want to do the challenge mode to make it like a lot better. It makes more fun. We need you to secure the memorial and remove the True Sun's forces. If they maintain this outpost, the True Sun's will be a direct threat to the campus.
Oh, what? There's a device in there. Look right there. B416! Oh, Socom MK16. Agent, you'll need to find a way to open that gate. No problem, no problem. We can get more loots in here with the AR. See, now we can easily get uh, P416 now. I mean, P416 is still good. I mean, even though they nerfed it, it's still good. I mean, what else are you gonna use besides P416? The rest are just still, uh, I don't know yet. I wanna say, like, they're not good, but they did buff some other weapons. Uh, this is a skill build, don't need it. Alright, get that. Ooh, what is that again? Now it's like it's exciting to find the new loots right now because of the special loot system. <clears throat> Which is I like. You know, I talked about this one, like, you know, give like excitement on the loot. And they did that right now by doing this kind of system. And I remember like posting this thing in like the ACR. See, now the ACR is stronger. Ba uh, higher base damage than uh, P416, but uh, ACRs has a little bit like slower than uh, ACR. I mean uh, P416. Uh, this one's a uh, Legro, that's why. <clears throat> Whoa. Oh, uh, I don't know. I'll pick it up. Uh, maybe that's like another damage I can use. But yeah, I did mention this thing in my uh, thing. When I submitted a um, suggestion about like excited loot, like a special loot that has special bonus, yeah, they did definitely listen to me, I guess, or maybe someone out there that did the same thing. But I'm one of those guys that posted some uh, excited loot, like a special loot, but they did it on their own. Uh, own way so now like looting is like it's fun again Yeah, my turret got my back in there. What you guys doing, yeah? <laughs> He's like basically tanking my explosive damage. Crazy. And this is just a hard mode too. And you're dead. Alright, killing me! Kill him! Turret, what are you doing, buddy? Yo, my trade is dumb. Alright. That can't be all of them. Check the interior while I get Henry's people to maintain the perimeter. Carbine seven. Carbine seven has high RPM. Wait, is this a new weapon? You know what? I want to try it out.
A Petra mask. Look at that. Three stats on Petra mask. Isn't that insane? Three stats in the mask. Usually, like Sokolov is the only one who gives you three stats in the mask. Now, also Petrov has that thing too. <clears throat> all right, let's give this uh this weapon a try. All right, this carbine. We just need to put like the twenty rounds of magazine, and. We don't want critical chance, we don't, we don't critical damage. We're just gonna like balance it with the the stuff that you lost. You can go with stability, but I don't think you need stability with AR man. Come on now. You can put critical chance if you want to, but it's not gonna make a difference for me though, because like I don't have any build for critical damage or critical chance on it. Um we're just gonna go with optimal range. You can go with accuracy too, but it depends on what you like. Actually, no, we go with damage to elites because we're using a skill build. Because this thing adds up on your damage on your skill if you put like damage to elites on it, right? Same thing as goes does this one. I'm gonna put damage to elite, so that's 13% damage to elite. And then we just put a pre will. Art candy. Alright. Let's see uh, how good this thing is. This uh, carbine 7. Wow, it's so steady. It's funny that that's not even the carbine I'm using. <laughs> it's like, wow, it's so steady. That's P416, J. <laughs> There's like a kind of like swinging kind of fort. Like, see, you see that kind of swinging fort? Yeah, the aim is going towards that side. Yeah, people want to say, look at this, it's like circle. Carbine is like going towards like upper side, which is like you can easily like uh, think that, control that. It's not the uh, thing, but it's still good. It shoots pretty fast though, but like. The aim is de definitely going this way. It's going definitely going that way. People want things still good, but uh, people might probably like this one better because the RPM is quite high, and the damage is not that different. But we're gonna keep on trying and using this one to get used to it, I guess. Because remember, like in PvP, though, the higher RPM, the better. But usually, like the most damage usually wins, though. But if you like, be must like balance like those two, like RPM and damage at the same time, like you will get the same result as the high damage one. Because she shoots real fast. As long as you land like more bullets than the other person you did. Or does, um, you're probably gonna win some fights on PvP though. But now it's like everything changed. Because you're not using the combination of your skill and your weapon damage to increase your damage output on PvP. But you just definitely want to go with skill build in PvE, especially doing some mission like this. That's a skill build though, the damage is kind of like high man. I'm doing like white damage, doing like 28 white damage as a skill build. That's not right. Right? That's not right. You know, type 3 for 1 6. Woo! Extra magazine. Woo! Um, while equipped skill deployed at full uh, thing to 25% duration charge and ammo. Well, mm, I don't 
don't know. And with spite. Yeah, I I could work with spite. I mean, yeah. Yo, that's basically a good weapon for like for like a skill build. A magazine headshot kills grant 35% skill damage for 20 seconds. While uh, equipped skill deployed at full armor have 25% duration in charge and ammo. So for your turret, like it increased by duration by 25%, which is it's gonna be a lot. Alright, give me something good, baby. Why you didn't give me any special uh, weapon, which is uh, AR? Ooh, wait, is this the one I need? I think that's the one I need. On the right side, please, on the right side. Oh no, it's still active, I forgot to destroy it. Oh please, let be the one on the right side. Please let be the one on the right side. Alright, I can probably change it now. Okay, here we go. Please, 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 please. Yeah, it is! Oh, let's go! 2,000 more damage! Oh, hell yeah! Hell yeah! You know, I'm gonna destroy all these things. I don't need this auxiliary battery. It's just like a waste of space. It used to be good before. Now it's. Oh, shoot! I just removed all my stuff. Hell yeah! <laughs> And it's close to like max cap too, because remember, three thousand. If you hit that three thousand or close to that three thousand, that's like close to like max. And if it's not close to like to three thousand, there's like more. More. I mean, there's like a room to improvement on your uh, damage, on your turret. See, it's like easier to farm, right? So, if you farm like uh before the patches, like the jokes on you. Because I can easily get whatever I want already. I want AR? AR I get. <laughs> I want some sets? Sets, items, I get, man. I already need that. We'll make that uh, SMG build. We'll, we'll make this SMG again alive. In this uh, in this update, I have an um, idea on it, but uh, I'm not sure if it's gonna work because, like SMG right now, though the quicko build, it's not that effective, right? So, And I like when opening this one, there's a chance that you get two, right? Like this one! Aha! See? Uh, P416. Oh no, it's G36. Yeah, G36 still sucks, though. See, uh, same RPM as like G, I mean, P416, but the P416 has better damage than G36. Camel launcher 273, auxiliary battery. Remember, we don't need auxiliary battery. You know what they forgot to add it though? Junk button on the skills. Looting on the skills. See, so look, this one, you can put it on the junk, right? By just pressing L2, right? Junk. Junk. This one, no junk. Right? They forgot to put the uh, thing, so I don't want to pick it up because I can't put it on junk on it. It's like e everything in here you want like shortcut, and then you can continue to do so.
Ah, we're gonna continue. Isn't there supposed to be a loot in here? I think they removed it. It's like the loot is like caught, I mean, like underneath in this one right here. I wonder if they add like all those things in like uh, all the areas. What the hell? Alright. It should be an easy one. And there's no more friendly fire on the thing, on the explosive. Remember like when you toss the, the secret mines and there's like a an AOE explosive? When you have that thing activate, that one right there, that thing doesn't work to you anymore. There's like no friendly fire anymore, which is good. I mean, the reason why like they die so fast is because this is just a hard mode. I want to like do like a heroic, but if I want to do a heroic, it has to be the invaded one, and I don't want to do invaded unless that uh, that invaded is inside the mission that I want to farm. It's pretty much like another like learning process again to make builds again. Because like everything's like changes. Right? There's also like one build that I wanna also make, which is like the AR build with crit build and use a boomerang. They buffed it up by fifty percent instead of like twenty percent, they buffed it up fifty percent and then you can, I'm gonna put like more critical damage on that build too. So sacrifice a couple of like weapon damage for crit build and critical damage build. Oh my goodness. Imagine like how much damage you'll be pulling off. That kind of setup. Hey, G. Full skill haze is also good for PvP. <clears throat> oh, by the, by the way, though, they nerf a uh, thing the spotter from 20% to 10%. And I love this trauma, man. It's not chance anymore. It's automatically headshot. Blind. Every 30 seconds. That's all I need. Ooh, I wonder what that is. I wonder what that is. Um, I believe it's in the bottom. That's right there. Alright, let's get this one first. Give me double loot! No, wah, wah. Purple, nurple. Alright, let me see. Come on, man. MK? AK? Um, I think the base damage is a little bit low for AK. So if this is definitely not the one that you want to use, though. I would still prefer P416 over that one. The RPM is not gonna cut it. I mean, like, the base damage is not gonna cut it because the RPM is low on that one. Hey, language, man. This guy. Yeah, I don't need those things. Alright, easy boss fight. Let's do this. I like when you go into turning corners now. Ooh. 
Yeah, it's still, it's still like the feeling that it, it's not right. Compared to P416 though. I'm not feeling this carbine. I'm not feeling it. Maybe you guys might like it, but it's not for me. It's a good weapon, it's a high RPM. Three bosses, I love it. Ouch! No, the guy's drunk. Oh no, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Thank god for that sub drop and roll on this weapon. I like how they changed that uh, the weakness point, right? Look at those loots! Oh my goodness! Woo! Okay, let me see. Holster 14.5% health with offensives. I don't know. Um. High RPM, but the, the damage is low. I don't like Famous. Probably like someone out there might like Famous. It's not for me. I want like a balance of RPM and the damage. I don't like the high RPM and low damage. Yeah, G36 is definitely not the one that you want. It's still P416. Okay. Check the next loot. Actually, I'm gonna put all those things in junk and just dismantle it. Og. High base damage, decent RPM. You put like a uh, um Allegro on this one. It might be a good weapon. Might be a good weapon. They buff up the lightweight M4 though. This is the rifle. Fall is like high base damage, but a uh, I don't like this weapon. Also, is because like a single shot burst. It's definitely not a weapon that you don't want to use as a PVP. It's that's like for like uh. People that very good at aiming. We just like want to hold that button and just drag it to the target, right? That's what we usually do the most. All right, let's go uh, dismantle all this stuff. Um, I, I don't know if I found a good item, but we didn't find that uh, special weapon that we're looking for, like this things right here, right? This gold. Gold named weapon that has like a special uh, perks on it. That's what we're looking for, right? Like this artisan right here, perfect rifleman. Look at that damage, twelve percent increased. Imagine this perfect rifle right here. Well, I wonder if I can transfer this in my uh, thing though. You know, what? I will try it if I can transfer that perfect rifle. I doubt it though. But I just want to see it. I know they would have used those weapons on us. We would have ended up like Castle. I can't tell you how relieved I am to have you on our side. Thank you. Today, we dealt a great blow to the True Sun's infrastructure. We confiscated a massive cache of chemical weapons right. and eliminated a stronghold near the campus. You should be proud. 
You saved a lot of lives today. What the hell? There's two here? White house and a blue white house. Okay, let's go see that blue white house. What is that? Finish shop project armadillo. Skill power, weapon damage, health, health restorer, too defensive and offensive as a uh, Gilligard chess piece. Interesting, but uh, uh, let's just keep Last it for now there. What? Is that? Um, you can now play with others. Group up with three friends in social menu. Invite players to your group while in public space. Group up with your friends in social menu. There, uh, you can leave a group at any time. You can fast travel to group members on the map. Yeah, this is sick. This is a good uh, way to like, you know, like... If you're doing a solo mission, right? They don't have to join you. It was like you have your own loot. But you can still like, you know, run to each other, but if that person needs help, you can just join them. Wait, is that how it really works? Public space and business operation settlement and safe house are great places to find other players. You can buy it. Okay. Hmm. That place already been like that before. What? I don't like this carbine. I'll go back to my custom P416. It's because this thing has optimistic. Right, I like that optimistic. <clears throat> Alright, let's see if I can transfer that. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm gonna go PvP on Friday and make builds on Thursday. That's why I'm just trying to farm as much as I can right now. And we... Trying to recalibrate this perfect thing in my MK17. I don't know what's a good uh, LMG right now, but just stick with LM um, M60 for now until like you manage to find the the high base damage. Because they nerfing this thing by twenty percent, and that's a big nerf. All right, so we're gonna transfer that. Um. All right, let's try, let's try this one. Oh, you can't. I knew it. I knew that. I knew that. I just want to see it. Yeah, you can't even remove it. It's funny that they even have this attribute change while all of them are the same. It's not weird. That means that they, they get to do something about this one? Is that what it is? But uh... Yeah, that's uh, it's weird. It's funny that when you do a PvP spec, I think doesn't even change. Like your health doesn't change, your armor doesn't change, your RPM doesn't even change. But uh, you can see your PvP damage now, finally. Oh my god, I hate this. So like learning how to. Uh... Okay. Yeah. So it shows you like the PvP damage right now, right? How much are you doing exactly on the player while you're using this weapon? But it's not even changing on the primary itself. Look, see if I change it, boom, PvP spec. But the primary damage is still 14.7. Right? It didn't change. 
is supposed to be changing to a uh, the primary damage to 14.7 to 10k but they didn't right, let's go open this Oh, that creeping chest piece? Ooh, that's gonna be so good. On bleed? PP or not? It's gonna be still good. I think it's this one right here. Oh no, this is Bloodsucker. Forgot. It was like the same thing as the same, uh, I mean, same status. Or like the icon. It looked the same. I think that's on the knee pads, I believe. Uh, damaging enemies with skills or explosive grandstand weapon damage for t uh, 15 seconds. Damaging enemies with skills or explosive grants a 10% weapon damage for 5 15 seconds. Uh, this is not for the skill build, I, I tell you right now. Because you need that red requirement into 9. So it's a, it's a good to like. Yeah, it's good for PvP. This one, Spark. Uh, PBE is like okay too, but it's definitely not for skill build. I will put this uh this spark into one of my hmm, damaging enemies with skill. So it has to be damage with a skill. So people will use a the drone here. They will definitely use a drone. For this one. Okay. Okay, I think I think I just have an idea for that one. Mm. Remember we still have to make that uh, armored armor regen build. I wanna see how effective that for PvP and PvE. Right, that's gonna be like so interesting to see, and I can't wait to test it out. If I have like fifteen, uh, fifteen thousand armor regeneration per second, I'll probably like just like run around and kite them until I get healed up, and then fight them back again. If the region is like non-stop regeneration, that's going to be OP. Because we're going to use the self-adjusting, right? People saying that it's bug, it's not actually bug. People saying that it's not it's not working, it does work. You just need to know how to use it. And this is what I'm talking about. This this thing right here is the one I'm talking about um this one right here, self self adjusting. We're just stacking up some armor regeneration in our build, <clears throat> and uh, see if it's how effective it is for PVE and PVP. Probably it's like the armor is gonna be slow regeneration, but it's still gonna help you though, right? Like if your armor got depleted, it's still gonna regeneration. So it's it's still like take away that pretty much like one bullet damage from you every second and the more the longer the like, thing they don't damage you like you'll get healed and then that's where you time to you pop your uh, armor kit and etc but i just need to find like those uh thing though the pieces for defensive like this one right here like armor regeneration right just need to stack it up all those things with uh Maybe health, but uh, this is the thing that I want to find though, not this one. I don't know if there's like a better version than this one, but this is definitely good. 
this is for pretty much like PvP gear mods. I want to find more of this thing. And of course, I want to find the regeneration. They nerfed the skill power in this one. Ah, uh, they didn't change this one though. But at least they separated this all those things. So much easier now to uh, spot them, which one you need to look at, right? Which is good. I like it. Um, and you can also like change your uh, thing, your list too, if you want. And you can assort them. Like recent find. Oh shoot, you don't want to do that. Oh crap, what did I just do? Um, Option, nope. Hold on, hold on. Option. Oh crap, Um, how do you unmark them? Oh shoot, I don't want to do that. Yeah, I definitely not, don't want to do that. If it's not in your favorite, it's going to put it as a junk. I guess that's like the fastest way to like thing though. Get rid of your stuff. Yo, I unmark it, man. Why are you giving me a warning for unmarking something that you don't want to break? Weird. This still, I think, is still dead. They should bring back the fifty percent increased damage with their uh. If their health is like down to 50% or 35% and you do like twice as much damage on the pistol, they should bring it back. It's like in the vision one, it's like the, that's how it works on the vision one. If their uh, armor is or like their health is like below 35%, uh, you do twice as much damage. So you can use this thing as a finisher instead of like just using it as a perk. I don't know why they didn't do that though, because I love using it. As a thing, twice as much damage. Alright, let's go check on this one. I'm supposed to be farming. I don't know what I'm just like talking about right now. Probably like some of you guys like this guy talk too much. <laughs> this guy talk too much, man. Can you just do a gameplay or something like that? I don't even know what he's talking about. They were going after the outcome. I already went here. I'm pretty much I finished this mission. I hear we're gearing up to kick black stuff at a Washington National Airport. <laughs> I already went there. Maybe I just didn't thought thing though. Alright, let's, let's farm more sets. Oh, there's one more uh, thing here that I didn't do. This one right here. Oh, thank God, there's one near here. Oh, I can just go to the dark zone. Yeah, I'm gonna do more like a lot of control point, but probably I'll do that like next week. Right now, I already have a schedule for like everything. Tomorrow is going to be like making builds. And then uh, I'm going to go do uh, PvP and thing. On uh, Friday, I'm going to do PvP on Friday. Both Dark Zone and Matchmake. Man, Sacred Mine is like more deadlier than before, man. Disgusting. Like, they nerf like how many, like, uh, cluster? 
on a seeker mine but they increase the damage what are they thinking man i love it and then i definitely want to try the the normal seeker mine that does the bleed i want to see how much damage the bleed does in pvp and pve and we're gonna use that ongoing directive to peace set That increase that bleed by 25%. Alright, let's go pick up all these materials. They increase this the size on this uh, materials from 400 to 1500. Was it 1500 or 2100? Yeah, 1500. Yeah, look at that. Ooh, so now I can craft. Like once I max this thing, I'm gonna start crafting. I love it. Well and I can't make this thing as a junk, so I'm not gonna pick it up. Too lazy to do it manually. They forgot to change that one though. There's no option to put you as a junk. So, you know what? I'm not going to pick you up. And <clears throat> they nerf compensated by 5%. The reason why they did that one is because it's not one of those things. Eh. I don't even know if I need anything from here. It's a Muromaki area, so it's gonna be a high chance of dropping Muromaki. 9.5 weapon damage on the chest piece? I think that's kinda low. <clears throat> Alright, let's go to that, um... Ooh, I love that! Did they drop? Did they roll? Woo! That looks so sexy. Look at this. Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I love that one. When I saw that, I was like, whoa! Hardcore parkour. Ooh, a perfect tech support. Yo, let's go! <laughs> A perfect tech support, let's go! Two utilities? Oh, we just pretty much got the godly! With armor? Hell yeah! <laughs> Yo, we just got this! Prescussive maintenance. We can change the. Maybe we can keep that hard hitting. Right? Keep that hard hitting. Well, we can change that hard hitting, to be honest, though. But yeah. Oh my goodness. 30%. Let's go. And two utilities also? Oh my goodness. See, this this is the thing that gives you excite when you opening some loots like that, like randomly, right? I got I just got name backpack. That's a name backpack, by the way, right? It's pretty maintenance. <laughs> For all the troll alps I got, true. <laughs> Oh man, I can't wait to uh, use that backpack. Sick. See? Sometimes, like, you just have to, like, you know, waste a couple of your time to write down some uh, suggestion, right? That's what I did. I wrote down some of the suggestion. Do I have to go down here? To go there.
Nope, it's not even connected to that side. If you go back to like the stuff that I wrote in the Discord, like I did mention about this thing, right? There's like no excitement in the loot when you like looting this stuff. So there's like sometimes like it's like really no point of like looting is because like everything is just junk. Now it's like they added that name special thing that uh, increases like some of the perks, the talent. Now it's like exciting to look these things now. Like every time you like you loot something, you want to check it out, and you know if there's like something really amazing on it. I'm gonna break this thing down. Like every chest is like definitely like important now, including weapon. By the way, including weapons, right? <clears throat> That's like a that's a small chance that you'll get it, which is fine. Which is that's this is pretty much like a looting game, right? Everything is like a an RNG, and it's supposed to be like that. Now you can pretty much like explorer and do whatever. There's a loot up in there. See, before I usually like skip it. Now, like I want to check it out. Maybe I might get this name weapon in this this loot right here. No, you just get the Alps backpack with 10% weapon damage, which is a uh, really good weapon damage, by the way. So, we're gonna keep it, because this is 10% weapon damage in the backpack. Wait, is that a backpack? No, it's a chest piece. Never mind. Wait, what's that considered a good uh, weapon damage in the thing, right? Was it 10%? No, I think it's 15%, right? The chest piece? Yeah. Eh, just break it down. Whatever. I thought that was a backpack. Alright, now let's go find this entrance. I see you every year, Mr. Duck. Oh, people! I I bet you know in this update they add some hidden, uh, hidden whatever something hidden that you have to do something to uh, find it. I bet you because they usually do that without even like mentioning it. Okay, how the hell? What's the entrance in this place? Ah, I see. Mission Starto. I want to get optim a special optimistic. That's what I want. Right? A perfect optimistic. I bet you it's going to be like 5% every 10% ammo is missing. Oh my goodness. That That's going to be disgusting. Okay, you go inside just to go outside. Okay, that's cool. That's pretty cool, I think. That's almost like a half uh, million right there. Imagine the alts that I got right now. Ooh, I like the music. The hell does a person still alive? G 
He's hitting 40k per second. That turret. Oh my goodness. It's pretty much like using my AR right now. That's as much damage as doing that thing. <laughs> Damn it, I was gonna put it on like my shoulders, so it look like he's like doing that to me. <laughs> and I'm gonna take a picture. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it would be nice with like, you know. <laughs> uh, I wish you can kneel down. Like, can I kneel down like this? <laughs> Take a picture of it? Nah. Oh, wow. That would be some nice picture of it there. Hold on, hold on. Someone's calling. It's, uh, the turret's still glitching through it, though. Hope they fix that, like, dropping. I don't like the secret mine dropping like that. Drones and turret. We might use this one as a high for drone. Yeah, we must like picking up everything. Right, we need everything, pretty much. I right, will see if there's like another like hidden loot I can get in here. All right, see if there's like another like interesting puzzle that they added in here. So far, just like one direction. Interesting. It's like, you know, we can just like push this thing out of the way and just go in there. I wonder if I can hit it. Okay, it doesn't work the way the other one works. So, um, let's see. Okay. Oh, it looks like this is the way to get in there. I think I have to drop? No? Put this in my pistol, which is I'm, I don't think I'm gonna be using it though. I doubt I'll be using that. So I got this already, it's automatic. Let's get a headshot. Activate it. Yeah, I need that hardwired, man. Every time my turret kills one, my secret mine's up already. Right? Feel like that 10 seconds is like a long way.
secure the marina. If something's blocking you, see if you can move it. Let's see. Huh. So there's no other direction to go in there. What? What? I can just open it? Maybe that's the that's the key for it? Okay. Fifteen for chess. Fifteen for chess. What do you mean? I don't get that. Fifteen for chess. <clears throat> Keep quiet. I have nothing in here. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, okay. 15 weapon damage on the chest. Alright, so. Oh, what the hell? I was like looking this one and I saw like I thought like this thing right here is connected to this one so I followed this line right here <laughs> and I was like what the hell? There's like nothing in there. Heads up agent, we spotted a boating coming to your location. Ooh. Ooh, I like that sound. Destroy the weapon style. I missed my uh, eight seconds uh, cooldown on my tur I mean, secret mines. Oh, maybe I have to open it or something like that. here right no loot and that turret's so e so nice to use it's pretty much like a lazy version but very powerful. Place it and leave it. Ignore it with the seeker mines blowing their face up. Electronic device detected. Looks like I need a key card or something like that.
I like the design on this one. Looks like you can go up in there. But how? From that window. Then you jump up in there to the other side over there, okay? Okay. <clears throat> this one's locked. Ah. Well, look at this. A stairs. But it's like leading we away from that area. I think you can go back in there later on. Let's go a little bit closer. That's a, that's a bad idea, Jay. I'm just gonna sh hit this guy in the head, get some armor. It's a large target. Oh, <clears throat> other side. that thing man why are you burning liar scrap let's see about that oh it's none okay so it's two-way direction from that side but there's a bottom here I can take oh no it's just going around okay never mind I have a feeling that there's a loot right here. Oh, not the loot I'm hoping for. No, there's nothing in there. <clears throat> Sometimes you just feel if there's like loot somewhere, right? If I'm the person that making the game or like placing all the loots, I will definitely place a loot in there. Okay, that's a stupid idea again. I just want to see what's going to happen if I shoot it. Because it's red. <clears throat> what the? I want to go upstairs, not downstairs. This is pretty much the same boat from the the other boats that we've been going to, right? But they just like added some a uh, lot of junks. Let's see like this, right? Another copy and paste. Uh, I guess that's fine. Um, unless you don't you won't notice it. I pretty much like I notice it right away when I see that explosive thing. Can I go up in there? No, it won't let me go up in there. Alright, let's get out of here. Um, where am I supposed to be going? Secure the manifest. 
the hell's a manifest? Go upstairs. Oh my god, I was just there. That's like the first Yeah yeah, I was just standing. Survive the outcast. Another boat is headed your way, agent. Oh that's cool! Oh nice! At least like they make the map like it's like actually like moving like Cause before like everything is just like standing in like one area right like If you go to this area like nothing really change Now like adding like a moving like vehicles like this it's pretty much like changed how like the, the game looks Is our dead. That secret mine will find you and kill you. The hell? Yeah, that weapon. I mean, this this thing is like so bad for the like, close range. Oh, this is the, that's the thing I'm looking for. What the hell? You can go from this way? Oh, you can go from that side. Interesting. And I only landed one. Go get him. No, help. <laughs> help, help! Wow, he survived that. Wait, it's finished? Where's the boss? Wait, is this the boss? Ew. No. Ooh, look at that bleed damage and explosive damage. Yo, let's go. Hell yeah. That three percent on bleed is really, is really good. I didn't see this loot before. This one's new. Cost on P416, 13.5 reformation, magazine size. Ah, no thanks. Oh my god, what the hell is that, man? Come on. <laughs> this game, there's like a jump scare on it. Okay, um. So I need to go this way. What? There's a lot of things I miss. Yeah, this mission sucks. Alright, let's go back. Alright. I ate, I ate, I ate, I ate, I ate, I ate. Alright, let's see how to 
No way. We need to match to go in there to that window over there. Still enemy just chilling in here. Nice. Nice seeker mine. Is there a way here? Okay, sir, you can't aim. There's like yellow wire right there. Yellow wire leads to... Nothing. What the? I'll restock. Hmm. See, I can go up in there, but how? I think that's the thing that I need to go up to. Interesting. Because there's the thing here that means I can jump down, right? So, yeah, I see it right there. So, what that thing opens, though? It looks like it opens up from downstairs. Is that what it is? Shot that one. So, I just have to follow. Whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. I think it opens this one right here. One up this thing here. Yeah, this thing right here. This thing opens. Oh, there's one more. So if I got that one. Right, that thing's connected to that one. Now, where's the other one? There's like two on the top. So it looks like there's. I have to shoot like one more somewhere on that top corner. I have to have a a right vision. See, I got this one right here. Where's the other one? Yeah, this this game, man. Hmm. No more angles in here. Where are you? Yellow. My guy, I need Sue. Kidding me, man? What the hell? Why do we need the two wires? Oh, 
My God, I hate this. No way. Is this what I think it is? They have this uh this hole to to see and peep. I thought that's gonna I thought it's gonna work for sector. God, I don't see it. That's the first one. Where's the second one? Mm. This sucks. Maybe I have to go in there to have a better vision, but how do you get in there? What the hell? This place, man. This sucks. It's like a simple puzzle, but it's like annoying. Hey, haven't been here. What the? Alright, I could probably see it in here. One of the... Can't see anything. I don't see it. It would be funny. It's just like in the bottom right there. I'm like working so hard to like figure out this stupid uh, this wire thing, but uh, it's it's it, it says there. No. It's in the top. No, I'll toss some grenades in there. Might probably work though. This place sucks. I'm gonna repeat it again. Uh, let's go back in the beginning. Maybe there is a. Uh, it's like leading towards outside. Right? Like leading towards in here that there's actually uh, things I can shoot. Right? Game's like making you think that it's just up in there, but it's not. No, I don't see. I don't see any lines. So it's, it's not there. And this is pretty much like the outside. So I doubt that something's gonna be in the hell. What the? Yeah, I see this one. Surge skill haze. Got this one. <laughs> More like true assholes. The two wires is still like going towards this side. Yo, the two wires is like right there. No, I think I already destroyed it. What the hell? Then how come it's still like thing? Yo, this game's weird. 
Well, let me see if I can find a, another area actually get in there. That's my only way. There's like a ladder in there to go up in there, and then I'm gonna go in there, and then that side right there, and then, then in there, and then I'm gonna come out like I'm gonna come out like really from that side right there. That's there's that's where the trophy is, and then I'm gonna jump down in there, and then I'm done. All right, but. No, that's not the case. I just need to open that. I need one more. Okay, well, let's go up here again. You know what? I'm going to use a nemesis so I can see better. Because I can't see it. Well, let me show it. Just need to find this angle right here. Jesus. What we find is like just like behind that wall right there. But uh this this right here is connected to the it didn't go up. Right? Damn it, you want me to go downstairs? That side right there, freaking wall blocked the way. Why am I blocking? Oh. Come on, man. Show it to me. Show it to me. I'm literally like going like every single corner to spot you. I hate this place, man. I'm about to give up. Jay, don't give up, man. I believe on you. Got this. Got this, man. This is one of the one I destroyed, right? It's definitely like that, and then connected to that, and there's like up there can't be on the ground it has to be on the wall can I just do a maneuver like parkour and then like do a balancing in this thing right here even though it's like as a uh, wired in here like a uh... wait Wait. Yo, I laugh if it's just literally right here. Where to try if it opens? So there's no hole, also. The shit from upstairs. Yeah, I'm about to just leave this place. I'm wasting my time in here. I could have like got like probably like ten loots.
All right, one more time going to the side right here. I think it's like right here. Like, I believe, or it's like behind there. What the hell? How am I going to see that? There's no way. Jeez, I can't see anything. It's like it's so blurry. It's so stupid. It'll be funny. This thing opens and then just like right there. It's still like going red. Alright, if I see a red, I'm gonna shoot it. That's this is like the only way to spot it. If you see a red cursor. That means, you know, I think it's glitch. I believe it's glitch. Because I, I shot it with Merciless. Maybe I have to go back in here. You know, I want to kill myself. I think it's glitch. Maybe the, the map will reset. And I could probably like use it again or a thing. Or shoot it again. Oh shoot, this is exit. Let's just cross finger that it reset. That's um I pretty much like went every single corner and I didn't see anything because um, I should be spotting this thing by now. If not, I'll come back in here again and redo it, but not today though. Please let it reset. Please let it reset. No, it didn't reset. Are you kidding me? Damn it, man. Okay. Um yeah, I think I'm leaving. I'll come back to this one. Two wires. Two yellow ones. And both of them is upstairs. I shot the other one, and the other one's like pretty much like missing. Maybe there's like certain angles that I have to go to find it.
right? There's like literally, I went to this balcony, I went to that balcony, and I still can't find it. Uh, one more tr last, like last ride, like this is like literally last ride, and I'm leaving this place. I'm done. If I can't still see it, if I s don't see my thing turn red, done. Done. I'm done. Maybe I did glitch it. There's only like one yellow circuit. Or is it? Oh. I think I just saw red. No, I lost it. Oh, again. Oh, there. I bet you that's the same target that I'm trying to shoot. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's really the same thing. Oh my goodness. Okay, I I'm give up. I gave up. I give up. That thing's glitch. I'm out of here. Yeah, there's like there's like a thing in there, ladder, and then I'm gonna get up in there. I'm gonna go here, and then this thing. This is like the last stop in here. Peace out, mission. Peace out. You know, I'm gonna do a quick. I'm gonna do this thing real quick. I'm gonna rush it, and then I'm gonna rush in there, shoot that thing, and see if it's god oh, thing. Maybe it is glitched out because I did it. I finished the mission, and then it's not supposed to open when you finish the mission. I don't know why it's not happened, but. Let's go try it. Let's do a quick one, a really fast one. Reopen in five days? Are you kidding me? Oh, well, then I come back in five days then. Not a problem. It's just gonna bother me for like the rest of the day. <laughs> Alright. So we're gonna stop it right here. I did waste a lot of time in there. So we're going to continue this tomorrow. We're going to make some builds. Let's see if we can put like things together. Hopefully I have enough. And then on Friday. We could probably like. If I have like extra more. Like, if I have extra time. I could probably just do a raid too. Alright. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching.